All right, so y'all know news been buzzing around Dame a lot lately. Choke No Joke did an interview with uh, with Comedy Hype, and one of the things he talked about during the interview was how Dame Dash has been blacklisted, blackballed from uh, entertainment. It said that Jay and Lior and Steve Style, just multiple different people have it out for Dame, and they want to make sure he don't have anything. And then, of course, they want him to sell Reasonable Doubt, and now reports come out that he owed the IRS maybe was seven eight million dollars between that and other things that he may owe and i see a lot of different people uh laughing about laughing at dame and uh some people were saying you know that's why you, you should listen to him you shouldn't have a boss and or you should have a boss and i think a lot of people they don't understand that dame is not broke you know he's people like that owe money man this country owes money you know how much money this country owe they said at one point we ain't gonna ever be able to pay the debt so owing money is nothing new dame will still live better than 99 percent of the average person and also just when it comes to his attitude like a lot of people didn't like dame because of how he went off on leo or he would go off on um kevin lyles and all these other people right you see it on backstage you know when he was going off on kevin lyles about the def jam jackets you see where choke put out the footage of him going off on def jam for planning a marketing meeting for jay-z the black album without dame dash or really any rockefeller representation being there but he wasn't in a wrong for that <laughs> they were supposed to let him know you know what I mean? Like whether it was Jay or or what's his name, John McNeely, all these other people that was there, somebody should have let Dame them know, especially when Dame, they're all a part of the same company. But what about Steve Jobs? Y'all know Steve Jobs and Bill Gates and all these other billionaires. They go off on people all the time. Just go watch uh, the movies on Steve Jobs or even just read the books on him. You will hear what people say or just pull up interviews on YouTube. People will tell you how he was and who he was to work with, but people love steve jobs they worship steve jobs they said steve jobs helps change the world but what about dame you know what i mean dame is a part of jay's success jay's a part of dame's success you can't tell the story of jay-z without dame dash same thing with kevin hart same thing with kanye west he helped give cameron a boost nori personally talked about how dame helped him one time with his contract with def jam and dame didn't even get it he didn't even get nothing of it he didn't want nothing of it he just wanted to look out for nori so dame's always been a good guy and, and businesses man businesses fail businesses are hard to to really start up and get off the ground everybody's take losses just like jay yeah jay doing his thing but remember y'all remember when jay-z had that hotel venture that didn't work and several other things man that's how business are but whenever it's people like us and you see us go up and down we always look at each other crazy but yet you know all these billionaires have filed for bankruptcy before y'all don't have nothing to say about it microsoft bought shares of apple one time and they're competitors now to help save apple and that's like coke buying that'd be like if coke bought shares of pepsi or vice versa come on now you know what i mean but that's how businesses work a lot of people don't know that and it's just sad how we look at dame man but dame is a is a legend he's an innovator he was looking at things years ahead even when apple them came out with the iPods, he came out with the was a I think it was called Rockbox. I mean, that was a great idea. We should have our own stuff like that. Even when it came to Rockaware and putting out putting out movies and only on record label. But then y'all say he arrogant. But what I, again? What do people have to say about Steve Jobs and all these other people who were great? You know, if you if you learn about the history, even if you learn the history about great leaders 100, 200 years ago, look how they were. You think they was just walking around all shy and timid and? And they and they wasn't standing up for what they believe in, no. But do I think to a degree, you know, the powers that may be try to keep Dame out? Absolutely. Now, do I think Jay did it? No. You know, I, I personally I don't think Jay did it, but uh, definitely the powers may be. And and but people don't understand again. Dame good. Dame went the art. Dame went the other things. Then he put out. He said he put all this money in Rachel Roy. He's good, man. Just go back ten years. Well, less than ten years ago. Go back listen to the interview with him and Kenyatta. Dame was on there dropping gems. But y'all want to sit here and say, oh, man, he owe money. But again, look how many people owe. Y'all owe money. This country owes money. <laughs> but that's just business, man. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.